What's up? So today's video is going to be another Ulta diving haul. And I know it's been a while since I've done a diving video, but um, one of my go-to places closed, another one locked. So I had to drive pretty far, find some new places to go. I wasn't always finding stuff, yada, yada, yada. So yeah, I started doing some different content on my channel, just like beauty, hacks, hair, things like that. So I'll list I'll link that playlist above and in the description box if you want to check it out. But if you just like the diving, that's fine. I made a playlist of all my diving videos. I'll also link that in the description box. And I'll be doing diving videos probably every Saturday or every other, depending on what I find, things like that. And beauty things and hair will be every Wednesday so I just wanted to let you guys know that so yeah let's get into this okay so I went diving at a few stores and I found a bunch of Ulta stuff and some other things from Ross there might be TJ Maxx I might have found something in here or maybe not um, I checked a bunch of places but before I start showing this, I also wanted to say I'm going to be having a giveaway. If you've been following me for a while, you know I like to do giveaways. So I'm going to insert a picture of what you could win right here. So it's just a bunch of like makeup, eyelashes. Everything is brand new. So... If you would like a chance to win that, you just have to subscribe, like my videos, and comment. The more comments you put on videos, the better chance you have. I'm going to pick a random comment. I have a little over 500 subscribers, so when I hit about 625, 625, then I'm just going to pick a random comment. So you guys just have to you know, hit the red subscribe button and comment and you have a good chance of winning that stuff. I don't have thousands and thousands of subscribers and so the chances of you winning are pretty good. All right, real quick, the first one I'm just gonna show you is what I got from Ross. It's just these two, like, you know, shelves. This is a black marble one. The only thing wrong was like this thing. Is it this one? I don't know. This one maybe was like loose. I already put my hot rollers uh, set in there. I'm gonna look forward to that video coming up, me trying them. And then I got this white one too. This is like, see? So I'm gonna have to like get something to, to make it stand up. But for now, I'm just gonna slide something under it. So yeah, and they're like, $28 or something, $27 each. So yeah, that's the two little things I got from Ross. So I'm going to start with um, the hair stuff that I found. I'm going to try to do this kind of fast so we're not here all day. I already had a long ass intro. Okay, so the first thing I found was this Amazing Grace Dry Shampoo. There's only like maybe the hair left but I really wanted to try this stuff so I, I grabbed it anyway and then next we found this revive and shine dry oil mist I'm not really sure how to pronounce that so I just I just don't know and it's like I always want to say like way dad but that it makes me think it's like a guy's product but then when I see Revive and Shine, I guess it's not. I don't know. I just always think that because I see Dad. All right. Next is, I think this is UA. I think this is how this is pronounced. If I'm wrong, I apologize. This is just an air dry foam mousse. I've, I've found this before, I think. I haven't tried it, though. It's pretty full. And the next thing's from Living Proof. It's this multitasking styler. It's a styling cream. I'm pretty excited about this. I mean, I have another one, a little one, 
that I've tried and yeah I've only tried it like once or twice I really want to give it a try now that I've been doing a lot of hair extensions videos and like hair stuff because my my natural hair will not hold a curl so I'm hoping like a styling cream will help if you know something that helps with fine hair hold a curl, please let me know. Flexible style spray wax. Okay, and then this IGK conditioner is pretty full. So is the Paul Mitchell, I'm sorry. And then I found this Sebastian. Okay, I'm just gonna say what this stuff is. It's a medium hold hairspray and it's it's full so yeah and then I found this um, conditioner smoothing conditioner I really like this brand I have a root spray from them and I heard the hairspray is really good all right I think that was all the hair stuff so and I also found this it's like a Ulta Beauty uh, you know face cleanser face thing I used to always use the um Clarisonic but I just don't use it anymore for some reason all right so now with the makeup well I also got this free little makeup remover packet okay so the first thing we got makeup is this bare minerals oops it's just like a powder it's in the shade soft medium if you can see if it'll focus all right, well, anyway, it's pretty full, so that's good. And then we got this Tarte Primer Opening Act. I actually really like this. I found this before, and I started using it, and I think it really helps make my lashes, like, um, longer. And then we found from Stila. It's just one of those, um, gosh, I wish this would... Sorry. Stay all day foundation and the little like concealer up here. I found it so many of these a long time ago. And it's in the shade medium nine. Milani um conceal and perfect con uh foundation and concealer and then we found the born this way multi sculpting concealer so like a foundation and a concealer they both look like they will um, match me one's natural beige the other's a light natural I'm trying to make this a little faster and then we got two tart shape tapes We have these two Juvia's Place foundations. Still haven't tried this, even though I have it. I just started like getting really into makeup again now that summer's over. So I'm going to start trying some of the things I actually have. And then we got from Pixie, we got this Milky Mist and this Retinol Cleanser. Also haven't tried this yet, and I have a bunch whatever and then we have this murad um i don't know some kind of moisturizer and i don't even know how much is in here uh, it's see it's all to the sides it's probably like halfway and then we got this one which looks like it's just like a bigger version of that maybe yeah also all to the side And then we got this NYX uh, candy stick lip gloss and this Ulta Beauty uh, liquid lip. Here is another NYX lipstick. This one is sealed, so I'm not sure. Hot in here, that's the shade. And then here's a NYX Bear With Me. I think it's like, yeah. Some like a cream blush. I I want to start trying cream products because my skin is so dry. And then here's another NYX No Filter Primer. Um, Peter Thomas Rolfe Instant Firm 
I heard this stuff was really good. It doesn't last, you know, but it works for a few hours to firm your skin. But who knows? And then we got this mini hula. It's like almost new. Just don't have the brush. Oh, from Benefit. And these are also from Benefit. It's just some, um, I think it's for, yeah, the Precisely Mine. Yeah. Sorry. And those are in shade 6 and 1. Alright. And then we got this It Celebration Foundation. That's like almost new. We got this Benefit Hello Flawless. Also in good shape. Got this Maybelline Fit Me. I'm actually going to start using this. I need a pressed powder. But it's matte. And like I said, my skin's dry. I don't know. Still might try it. And then we got this Stila. We got it. Eyeshadow palette. This is from Ulta Beauty. Sunset Skies. Very pretty. Almost, it looks like the hood, uh, the hood, um, palettes. All right, we got some the ordinary, um, hyaluronic acid. I really like this brand. It's very affordable to skincare. So if you're looking for some good skincare, that's a good one. We got this Dermalogica Daily Resurf Resurfacer, and it's definitely full. We got this It. It's like a foundation powder thingy. So there's that. And we got another one. I get like so many. Um, wow, that's like really good. I find so many of the same stuff. All right, and then we got this Nick. I mean, not Nick's Urban Decay like palette, face palette. All right, and then we got this from Revlon. Um, it's like a it's a foundation. I've never heard of this before. Then we have from Pixie. Um, the vitamin C tonic. We have two of these Morphe um, setting sprays. This one's maybe half. This is pretty full. I kind I like this setting spray, although I don't really use setting sprays. I guess I should. I don't know if they make a difference or not. Then we have an all nighter, which is only like to here. And we have a Smashbox priming water. And then we have this cake, the Sheen Queen. And then we have this NYX Shine Killer and this NYX Lip Pencil. And then the last thing I found was this Crystal Zodiac Palette from BH. I'm going to try and show it to you, the middle one, because they taped it. See, I like pressed it down because it was all crumbly when I pulled the tape off. So I'm going to have to figure out to pull the tape off the rest. Hopefully it doesn't mess them up. But this is a really pretty palette. So.
guys, that was everything I found dumpster diving at Ulta and Ross. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and hit the red subscribe button. Again, I'm doing a giveaway as soon as I hit 625 subscribers. So just hit the red subscribe button and comment and you'll have a good chance of winning. Again, here's the picture of the giveaway. So yeah, and to those of you watching my other content, the beauty, hair, things like that, I thank you, I appreciate that. And I'll be doing diving still though, if that's what you'd like every Saturday or every other, depending, and beauty, hacks, and hair on Wednesdays. Alright guys, 